Then for UZZ, Central Alabama Skywarn, we're watching a cell that has a severe thunderstorm and has a big hail core and has reportedly egg-sized hail in Marengo County that is now moving towards the east into Dallas County. And that cell might make it to Autauga and Lowndes County. We don't know yet, but we're watching that cell. And for UZZ, Central Alabama Skywarn. Central Alabama Sky warned the severe thunderstorm cell that we're watching is now the subject of a severe thunderstorm warning for most of Dallas County. And the storm is expected to reach Mounds and Otago County, uh, specifically the uh, uh, Whitehall area, in about 45 minutes. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. National Weather Service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Elmore County. At this time, a severe thunderstorm is just to the uh, southwest of Blue Ridge getting ready to cross over 231 and head northeast towards Claude and Kent. Uh, W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. This, this storm has, in its history in Marengo County and uh, Dallas County, uh, dropped uh, uh, large hail. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn, standing by for weather-related traffic. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, sir. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. Vaughn and Bell Auto and light rain and lightning at the moment. Vaughn and Bell, light rain. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn, standing by for weather related traffic. KN4 DUV with a relay. Go ahead. KN4 CWY reports cloud and air maxwell. That cloud to ground lightning at Maxwell, appreciate it. And we have a report of quarter size hail at the Tallapoosa water plant in Elmore County. W4AP Central Alabama Skywarn. Uh, for everybody's information, the Tallapoosa water plant in Elmore County is near Emerald Mountain in south central Elmore County. W4AP, Central Alabama Scott One. Central Alabama Skywarn. A severe thunderstorm with quarter size hail is now just north of Emerald Mountain in the uh, uh, between the Claude and Ware areas of Elmore County, moving northeast at 40 miles per hour. Uh, as I said, the storm has uh, hail with it and uh, extensive uh, uh, cloud to ground lightning. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn, standing by for weather-related traffic. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn, the severe thunderstorm that is moving through Elmore County, the southern part of Elmore County. Uh, the storm is moving northeast, will be in the Tallahassee area in the next 10 minutes. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. W4AP, KM4CBL. Go ahead. Uh, 
southern, south central Elmore County. This storm has just moved past us. Uh, nothing severe in it at this point here. Just uh, rain, a little bit of lightning, and a lot of thunder. Yeah, thank you very much. Are you in the uh, Emerald Mountain area? That's affirmative. I'm very glad to have that report. Nothing severe in your area. Uh, the strongest radar echoes have just passed through there, and uh, glad to hear that. It's quickly moving on to the uh, northeast towards towards Tallahassee. Uh, W4AP, Central Alabama Sky Warren. Thank you for that report. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky Warren. The strongest echoes on radar from this severe thunderstorm cell in Elmore County. We're now between Claude on Highway 14 and extending to the south to Ware, which is east of uh, Emerald Mountain. And uh, this cell is moving at about 40 miles per hour uh, towards Tallahassee. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky Warren, standing by for weather related traffic. Central Alabama Sky One. Severe thunderstorm is now moving through southern uh, Elmore County towards Tallahassee. And uh, uh, we might take note there is another strong cell that has no severe warning yet, uh, but it is uh, crossing I 65 at the 158 mile marker at the Flying J and moving to the northeast and maybe affecting Montgomery County and uh, the eastern part of the city of Montgomery uh, oh, as it goes to the northeast. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky 1. 4 PMD Mobile. PMD, good morning. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky One, the National Weather Service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for that storm uh, that is now crossing I-65 at the 158 mile marker in um, uh, Lowndes County uh, near the uh, Flying J truck stop. This uh, storm is moving to the northeast on, and will affect Pope Hall, Snowden, and Pike Road before it goes on into southeastern Elmore County. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn, standing by for weather related traffic. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. The uh, severe thunderstorm that has moved through Elmore County is now in the Tallahassee area and is moving into Tallapoosa County. It's no, long, no longer a significant threat for uh, Elmore County. The uh, National Weather Service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning uh, for Montgomery County and Lowndes County. A severe thunderstorm is crossing I-65 at the 158 mile marker and is moving northeast towards Snowden and Pike Road. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky Warren, standing by for weather related traffic. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky Warren. Quarter size hail is associated with a severe thunderstorm. It is now crossing I-65 near mile marker 158 near the Flying J where uh, it is now crossing into Montgomery County and is heading towards Snowden, W4AP, Central Alabama Sky Warren. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky Warren, the severe thunderstorm cell. That's the subject of the National Weather Service warning is now in uh, southeast uh, is, is now in Montgomery County 
southeast of the city and heading towards the area of the Southern Bypass and Highway 231 and is moving northeast. Um, the rains do extend eastward and southeastward into Pike Road, but the strongest echoes are near Highway 231 and the uh, Southern Bypass. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn, standing by for weather-related traffic. Good morning, Sir Ron. We have a severe thunderstorm that has just passed Highway 231 near the Southern Bypass. It's moving to, towards the northeast. Moving towards uh, East Chase and Taylor Road, um, it has uh, some hail with it. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky One. It's got power back on and problem. Roger. Sorry to hear you had power out. Glad it's back on. A severe thunderstorm on the southeastern side of the city of Montgomery uh, still has uh, quite a bit of uh, potential for large hail. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. The weather service has allowed the severe thunderstorm warning for Montgomery to expire. The strong thunderstorm is still uh, south of I-85, um, near about the 15-mile marker, uh, somewhere between Middling and uh, Shorter, uh, middle, between Middling and Wall, and uh, is moving to the northeast. Still has the potential for some hail, but it is no longer a severe thunderstorm. W4AP. N4UZZ, KN4TUB. For TUB, go ahead. This is Major, you were still in here, Auto. I'm watching those cells to our southwest. Roger. <laughs> well, we got a break. And, uh, now we're watching a cell that's out in Wilcox County to see if it's going to head this way. I'm watching too. Well, we're mobling. Uh, we've got to go up and do some work up in Elmore, but uh, I'll have my HT with me and I'll be listening out for you. Sure. Sounds good. Be safe, 7-3. See if you can stay dry. Ha ha. KN4 TUB, N4 UZZ. 7-3, KN4 TUB. W4AB, KN4 TUB. KN4 TUB, N4 UZZ, go ahead. Hey, Otto, just gonna let you know I'm up here on 231 in Wasumpka. And visibility is down to about 100 yards. It's got some pretty heavy rain coming down. Bed, heavy rain, low visibility in Wetumpka. Appreciate the report. N4UZZ. N4UZZ, this is KN4TUB. UB, N4UZZ. Can you relay to EM, uh, to Elmore County that Edgewood Academy has no power, please? It will do. And for you, ZZ. Thank you, Otto. Okay, and for TUB. For TUB. Traffic delivered. And for you, ZZ. has issued a tornado warning for Montgomery County. 
At this time, uh, there is a severe thunderstorm that is capable of producing a tornado in the Fort Deposit area of Lowndes County, and it is moving northeast towards Sprague. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn, standing by for weather-related traffic and weather observations. Central Alabama Sky Watch National Weather Service has issued a, a tornado warning for South Montgomery County. A tornado is moving from the Fort Deposit area uh, just north of Highland Home towards Sprague and um, uh, heading northeast in South Montgomery County. This is W4AP, standing by for weather observations and weather-related traffic. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. A uh, tornado is moving from the Fort Deposit area to the northeast towards the Sellers, Sprague, and Raymer area in South Montgomery County, W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn, National Weather Service has issued a tornado warning for South Montgomery County. At this point, a tornado is on the uh, county line between Crenshaw County and Montgomery County to the west of Sellers, heading towards Sprague and getting ready to cross Highway 331 south of Sprague. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. Radar suggests that the tornado rotation is now crossing Highway 331 in the Sprague area in South Montgomery County. This storm is moving to the northeast and is likely to intersect Highway 231, the Troy Highway, uh, just south, uh, I'm sorry, just north of where Highway 82 goes off, and it will probably do that in about 10 minutes. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. W4AP, this is KN4UXO. UXO, go ahead. Strato, what you just announced there, that sounds like it's going to get pretty close to my QTH. Uh, is that uh, the same area near Old Carter Hill Road? It is. Uh, it, uh, is likely to be passing just to the south of you, but it is going to be very close. Uh, thank you for that. I appreciate your help out there. We're listening, and uh, thanks again. Pay in for UXO. Roger. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky One. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. The National Weather Service has issued a tornado warning for a tornado that has moved out of the Fort Deposit in Lowndes County area and has moved northeast, north of Raymer, and is moving northeast and approaching Highway 231. It is now in the Davis Crossroads area and is getting set to cross Highway 231 in a few minutes. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. K4DJO Mobile, East Montgomery. What's your location? Edge Ferry and um, uh, the back end of Walmart. Roger. A tornado is approaching Highway 231 
in about the area where Highway 82 branches off. And it looks like the rotation is uh, just to the south of that intersection of Highway 231 and Highway 82. So it'll proceed northeast uh, a bit to the south of the uh, Farmington community. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. AK4 GNG. AK4 DJ Mobile. Uh, thanks, L, and go ahead, Dave. Delay, uh, heavy winds, heavy rain, and I've already had a lift hit my top of my house, so it's getting a little bit nasty right now. Roger, heavy winds and rain in Delrada. Thanks for the observation. Appreciate it. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. Uh, it looks like from the radar that the rotation has crossed Highway 231 at the intersection of 231 and 82 and is moving northeast, staying well south of the Farmington community. It is heading towards Vaughn Road, Highway 110, somewhere between Cecil and Mitchell in Bullock County. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky One. So oh, it's uh, K4DOA. Wait, go ahead. Boy, it's raining like you won't believe. It's coming down very hard. The wind is blowing real hard. Traffic is moving real slow. I'm Green Acres and Vaughn Road near Highway Exit 485. That heavy rain, uh, very heavy rain and winds um, south of uh, Exit uh, 4, I think. Uh, exit 4, I think it is, uh, on I-85 in the Vaughn Road, the Green Meadows area. And uh, batting down the hatches, here it comes. Roger, Roger, W4AP, Central Alabama Sky One. In 4AU. In 4AU, go ahead. Yeah, I told rain right here just hit six inches plus per hour. A little bit over six inches per hour. In 4AU. Roger, Roger, very heavy rains. North of Wetumpka in the Wallsboro area. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. W4AP, KN4TUB, mobile. TUB, go ahead. I am eastbound on Highway 14, headed back into Wetumpka, and then coming back down into Montgomery. Uh, there is heavy rain on 14. Visibility is down to about 50 yards, and uh, reduced speed. There's a new tornado warning for Elmore County. There's a rotation indicated just south of the city of Wetumpka, just south of the city of Wetumpka, near the Walmart, near the Lowe's store. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. I'm headed in that direction. Auto, I will advise. Sure. K5BGU, check in. BGU, go ahead. What's your location? Uh, Auto 5 Southeast of Wetumpka, uh, just got my eyes on things right now. now I don't, I'm not seeing anything, the wind is picking up just a little bit, uh, but that's it right now. To that, this uh, rotation is moving rapidly uh, at the, to the south of the city of Wetumpka. It is moving to the northeast. It will be crossing Highway 14 and moving towards the town of Elmore. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. 40 Jail. JL, go up. We're experiencing uh, straight line winds, looks like in uh, whiteout rain at uh, West Ferry and uh, uh, where am I? Atlanta Highway. Do you see anything on radar about this uh, auto in this area? I do not. That's Roger, K4 Jail. is now to the southeast of the Farmington community in Montgomery County and is heading into Macon County. 
It is approaching Highway 110 between uh, to the east of Cecil. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky Warrant. Rotation is indicated just on the south side of the city of Wetumpka, and it is moving northeast rapidly towards the town of Elmore. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky Warrant. OMD, Dad. DW, go. Anyone out there that you can see, and they might want to go toward Wetumpka Elementary, that uh, tornado is moving right straight at it right now. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. The uh, uh, rotation indicated now is just to the south of Highway 14, east of uh, we, the town of Wetumpka. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. Yes, K5VGU, strong, strong inflows uh, from me towards the tornado area, uh, Otto. Very strong inflow, heavy rain. There's strong winds, heavy rain, east of Wichamka, W4AP. M4CDL. DJL, go ahead. Uh, strong winds, very, very heavy rain, south central Elmore in the Emerald Mountains. That's strong winds, heavy rain uh, in south central uh, Elmore County. Uh, the rotation that is the subject of the National Weather Service warning, tornado warning, is about seven miles north of you and moving to the northeast. W4AP, Central Alabama Scott 1. Roger that, team 4 cbo W4AP, Central Alabama Sky One. Just making it to the uh, repeater on the HT up here at 111, but I mean, this is the radar. I said it's going to the northeast of us, I think. Uh, it was just a little bad uh, at first, but uh, we're just making sure I was getting in there and uh, didn't know. If uh, you can tell me if we had anything else right here, right this minute, I hadn't had time to check the radar. Uh, W4, JFF. JFF, uh, the ro indicated ro the rotation is about uh, um, five miles to your southeast, and it is moving northeast along Highway 14. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky 1. USL, thank you there, Otto. Okay, we'll be monitoring and uh, I'll get out of the way uh, for uh, more weather traffic there. And uh, we'll be on the side if you need anything, give us a shout. Step uh, before JFF. TUB. TUB, go. I'm on West Bridge Street in Wetumpka, heading back towards Elmore, trying to spot anything. I do not see anything right now. It's light rain, visibility has actually increased. And I don't see any signs of rotation at the moment. I'm still spotting. Rotation is now to the south of Highway 14 and about five miles east of the city of Wetumpka. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky 1. A5 BGU, auto winds just picked up significantly here south of, this, of where the tornado uh, indication was. Thanks for the report. Appreciate it. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky 1. Service is continuing the tornado warning for Elmore County. We have an indication on radar of a rotation east of the city of Wetumpka, south of Highway 14. It is moving east, northeast, very rapidly. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky 1. WJC. WJC, go ahead. Uh, located just northeast of uh, Lake Martin Dam, uh, moderate rain, standing by. For that, the uh, warned tornado 
with the uh, rotation indicated on radar is now moving towards the Claude area in high, on Highway 14. It is moving to the northeast, and uh, much of Kawalija and Lake Martin are included in the warning area. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky Warning. N4PMD, W4. N4U, W4AP, N4PD, N4PMD. PMD, go ahead. Just some flooding, line of highway at uh, Coliseum Boulevard, whole intersection. To that highway being flooded uh, near Coliseum Boulevard, appreciate it. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky Warning. KN4 TUB. TUB, go ahead. I'm back eastbound past the old Russell plant on 14 Auto. I don't see anything, any kind of rotation. Uh, I'm going to have to call it off for now, though. After that, we have a report of a tree on fire. Power lines are down in on Central Plank Road. W4AP, Central Alabama, Skywarn. W2LQY. W2LQY, go ahead. Located uh, Lake Forest, uh, Arrowhead area. Uh, the strong storm blew through, uh, knocked over our aluminum flagpole. For that, appreciate the report. Thank you very much. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. For AP, Central Alabama Skywarn, the indicated rotation on radar at the National Weather Service has issued a tornado warning for in Elmore County is now to the east of Claude along Highway 14. W4 AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. Go ahead. Can you advise on this new alert? I just got warning in Montgomery County from NWS. That's a tornado that is in the extreme southeast corner of Montgomery. It is uh, on the uh, corner of Montgomery and Pike County and uh, Bullock County, and it is moving into Bullock County. Uh, it is uh, crossing Highway 231, um, uh, right, and is uh, moving into Bullock County. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky One. Thank you, KN4 TV. The 4 AP Central Alabama Skywarn. The concern in Elmore County has moved out of the Kent area and has moved into Tallapoosa County. W4 AP Central Alabama Skywarn. We have a tornado warning for extreme southeast Montgomery County. A uh, rotation is moving into Bullock County in the area of Pine Level. And we have a warning for and extreme southeastern Montgomery County. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky. HIG. Go ahead. Power is completely shut down with trees across the road. Air Tower Road? That is correct. And I appreciate the report. Fire Tower Road in Elmore County, which uh, goes down to Highway 14. The Redland Road to Highway 14 is completely shut down with trees across the road. W4AP, Central Warren. Central Alabama Sky Warning. We have reports of trees down and power lines down on Highway 94 between 17 and 18. Highway 94 in South Montgomery uh, uh, that runs through Raymer from 31 runs through Raymer and then east to the east and southeast. W4AP Central Alabama Sky Warning. And UB, go ahead. 
I'm listening to the uh, county fire department right now. And South Montgomery said it's pretty rough down there on Highway 94 right now. They can't even get out of the station right now, they said. Roger. W4AP, thanks for the report. Evanston says just issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Barber, Bullock, Elmore, Macon, Montgomery, Pike, and Russell counties until 12.45 p.m. Severe thunderstorms are in the area, and some cells have rotation and have uh, uh, tornadoes. Observe tornadoes and radar indicated tornadoes. W4AP. Central Alabama Skywarn, standing by for weather-related traffic. Weather Service has allowed the tornado warning for Montgomery County to expire. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. And 14 UP. go ahead. I just turned on Coliseum Boulevard uh, towards Atlanta Highway. Right here at Coliseum Boulevard and Federal Drive, both the state troopers, Grassy Field, and across the street at the Beacon Hope Church, they're both flooded completely, Auto. Roger. Report. Thank you much. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn. W4AP, Central Alabama Skywarn, reports of significant uh, of uh, trees down indicating tornado damage on Troy Highway in Montgomery County. 4AP, Central Alabama Sky 1. AP, Central Alabama Sky 1, the east side of, the east of the bypass, and including Pike Road and Highway 231 are under a severe thunder. Uh, a line of severe thunderstorms is moving east through the area and moving into Macon and Bullock County. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky One. Central Alabama Sky Warn. The National Weather Service has issued a new tornado warning for extreme southeast Montgomery County, south of Pine Level. A uh, tornado is at uh, 231 and is moving to the northeast into Pike and Bullock counties. W4 AP, Central Alabama Sky Warn. Central Alabama Sky Warn. Radar now indicates that the echoes of the severe thunderstorms have all left Montgomery County to the east. W4AP, Central Alabama Sky Warn. N4TUB. UP, N4UZZ. Per South Montgomery Fire Department, it is tornadic damage down around the 26,000 block of Troy Highway. Um, vehicles overturned, multiple trees down. Appreciate it, we are aware. N4UZZ.